Hi everyone, it's your girl Chi Washington and I'm back with another video. I'm just about to go out so I thought do you know what it's been a long time since I filmed anything so I'm gonna film an unboxing a lovely unboxing that came a few days ago where do I have something let me just go get some scissors one second okay so I've got this luxury unboxing this one is black owned because your girl is trying to support I got my tail car coming so I'm looking forward to that this one is from Brandon Blackwood so oh, i'm so excited i'm actually gonna do it in two videos because your girl needs content so i did buy two things I'm gonna have to find out what this one is by watching my next video but for today i'm going to focus on this because i think i'm gonna wear it out today it's from brandon blackwood as i said um if we have a look at the box oh branding branding for brandon um i've been seeing brandon blackwood around the place um like it came onto my radar last year but it's really this year that i've been thinking no, i need to purchase and i've been watching a few youtube videos if you're interested in brandon blackwood then i suggest going over to lavish lavishly chi um my namesake my name twin um chi and chi but has chi lavishly chi with her i um and checking out her videos because she's got lots on brandon blackwood um and yeah so i went onto the site and i feel like i did pay over the odds because of the um current exchange rate is not in the favor of the pound sterling but i'm still happy so let's see here's what it looks like inside the bag the dust bag is very it's giving me jack moose vibes oh child i am trying to do a look today do we like this headscarf look the headscarf feeling like it's trying to slide off my head these braids need to be done need to be taken off but yeah there's a little note from brandon so let me see what he has to say to me handwritten thank you for your purchase enjoy your new piece can't wait to see how you style it i'll be sure to tag you okay <clears throat> why am i being weird i don't know you know when i haven't filmed in so long i'm like do i know what to say anyways let's get into the unboxing oh the bag is big oh i'm gonna be able to fit things in here today oh 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 okay so I decided to go for something fun. So I went for the cow print. And do you see what I'm doing here? Print on print on print. All black, print, print. I'm gonna wear some black shoes. I'll show you what I'm gonna, I'll show you the full look and see if we agree. It's a very, it's a very casual vibe that I'm going to today. But yes, Brandon. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Oh, it smells so new. Oh, yeah. So it's the pony hairs. Um, and yeah, first impressions. I love it. It's so cute. Like I wanted, um, I've got the coach chalk and I wanted another white bag. So I don't really wear stark white. So like the chalk is as white as I really want to go. This has gold hardware but i wanted like a white bag that is different so white and black with silver hardware so i'm really excited about this so let's see you just um clip open the b and as i've seen in reviews it doesn't open too wide but it's wide enough to be able to put your hand in neatly and get all that you need to get out of there it's got a strap so that's all i love it when um a package is like properly wrapped up packed up like looking good so i'm happy with that even got a little sticker on the brandon blackwood oh and it's um like an embossed no not embossed it's a uh, engraving so it's like it's raised that is giving lux the clasp has got the b giving lux and on the b it says brandon blackwood can we focus camera oh yeah there we, see. there we go um so yeah 
Okay, so I've got the things that I want to take with me today. Oh, where's my phone? No, my head scarf is slipping. I got to readjust myself. Give me two seconds. Ooh. Child, I have not um, filmed in so long. And you know that when it's an unboxing, if it's going to be a true unboxing, it's one take. <laughs> it's one take. There's only one time that you're going to see it for the first time. So, um, yeah. So I have got the stuff that, okay, let's take off the wrapping first of all, because I know I'm keeping this bag. Um, where's my scissors? I just had. So let's cut off the tag. <laughs> oh, child. Okay, so look, the tag has got Brandon Blackwood's name. I mean, there is a lot of attention to detail. That is really cute. This is a care card for the different um, types of material that he sells. He used to sell um vegan leather eg aka should i say um fake leather but now he sells real leather so the price has gone up everybody i didn't know when the price was cheap but it used to be um a lot more affordable it's still affordable but it used to be cheaper basically um but yeah obviously you're gonna pay more when you're paying for um when you're paying for leather so it's gonna cost more everything is just wrapped up nicely and um, this i believe used to be in the pony hair but because pony hair if you rub on it um for an extended period of time it bolts he's made a very smart choice to put this as leather which i don't mind at all like obviously it would be cute if it had all of the cow print but it's it's like it's, it looks cute and it's functional functionality over everything because we can't have something that looks cute that's going to be bold in a, in a matter of months that's a bit ridiculous and like this is not going to be an everyday bag so i don't have any worries about it bolding um because i don't think i'm going to be wearing it down like that that that's going to be an issue oh yeah the hardware is really giving no this is definitely the look look at am i a fashionista what this bag is giving it's giving i love it um it's got little feet at the bottom protectors i'm gonna take that off because uh it's like okay how long am i gonna protect it when will i ever get to enjoy it it's a little bit squishy as well oh ah, uh, you know what i love i love a structured bag so this is giving me everything i need from a bag structure cuteness like cow print it's very in fashion at the moment okay or am i shouting but it's very it's very in fashion but it's also like i always i've always loved animal print so even when it's out of fashion i'm still gonna be wearing the bag okay so let's see why am i shouting Oh, I'm not used to filming anymore. I'm so sorry. Who am I? Like, what's my personality? I don't know who I am right now. Am I just like every other person on YouTube? <laughs> Look, it's a hobby and it's not a hobby because like, am I relaxing by doing this? Yeah, I am. <laughs> I do like buying bags. Yeah, 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 yeah. But the like, the like editing of videos and stuff, it takes time, you know. So anyways, I've got the iPhone 13 mini and i have the mini phone because i want my phone to fit in my bags so look at this the gucci super mini my phone fits in that no problem because look i'm not having all of these mini bags for my phone to not fit the jacques mousse it fits it fits it fits it fits every bag it fits so um obviously this bag does fit in there and if we see it's got loads of space so I can even, oh, no, I can't. <laughs> I thought I could lay it flat, um, as in this way down. I can't. Okay, so I've got all the things. So I've got my phone. I've got my um, key holder. I've got my um, card case. Do you want to see what it looks like in the bag? It's kind of hard to show what it looks like in the bag. I'll show you when I'm done. I've got, I'm putting it in 
from most essential to least essential. So hand cream, need that. Mirror, need that. Um, AirPods, I do need this because I'm going on the train today. So I need to listen to some music. Um, today, I can't find my lip liner. So either it's going to be a Carmex vibe, um, which is basically just a lip gloss that's like mentholated, moisturising, SPF, you know. Or it's going to be the Fenty Beauty. But I can put them both in there, to be fair. I got a san hand sanitizer, and I'm going to be very honest with you. I bought this purely for the aesthetics. It costs way more than a normal, not way more, but it costs more than the normal um, hand sanitizer. But it's cute if it's my aesthetic or whatever. So, oh, chow. It's a bit too full up. Do you know what? It fits. I just have to. I have to um, be a bit smart in the way that I place it. So all of that does fit. But, oh, child. Yeah, it's a bit too full up. Okay, so let's take out some of the... Oh, I forgot my shout wipe. Even though I'm wearing all black, this is um, a stain remover um, thing. In, instead of the tie to go pen and um, a wipe. So I'm going to put that instead of the hand sanitizer. Um, and there. It's the hand sanitizer that was a bit too bulky for it, but look. Oh, it's so cute. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. I'm so happy with it. Oh my gosh. Why do material possessions make me so happy? <sighs> I am a consumerist, okay? I am, I am, I am, I admit it, and I don't care, because this has filled me with joy. I'm gonna feel so happy just wearing this today. Like what? Should I wear the strap? I don't think I need it because this is such a cute top handle bag. But let's show you what the strap looks like. Oh, so it's got this little um, tab. I mean, there's a lot of plastic. So I don't know if people who care about the environment. I am one of those people. I'm not a protester, but uh, yeah, it's maybe more plastic than is needed. Oh, thank God. I thought it didn't have a second one to hold this because I hate it when it doesn't have that because like this all over the place is just a mess. And sorry if I keep looking here instead of here. I want to look at you guys in the eye. I don't know why I'm looking at myself. <sighs> just want to see if I'm in the shot, you know? Okay. And someone's asked me, okay. Side note, I was at a party with my cousin and we are in the toilet and I was just like talking with her and then someone came out and they said to me, oh, are you from the States? And I was like, oh, no, we're not. Um, I didn't even clock that we were talking in American accents because we do that all the time. And I clocked in my videos, I do that a lot. I don't know if it's annoying, like, is it annoying? It's it's such a normal thing to do in the UK. And like, obviously we have our own culture in the UK, which is thriving at the moment because Americans are loving us right now. But at the same time, is it cringy to Americans to hear us put on our accent? Does it sound rubbish? Because I don't know where I'm supposed to be from. I'm notoriously bad at accents, but I always feel like I can do a basic American. Okay, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take the strap with me because what if I don't want to hold the bag? Um, I'm going out for my friend's birthday. It's like drinks and food, although I'm not going to be drinking too much. But yeah, oh my gosh, I love it so much. How long have I been recording for? Where's the time? Uh, oh, eight minutes, 48. That's not too bad. Okay, so this is a quick video. I think I'm going to film the second one now because I can't wait. But I'm going to do it in a separate video. So if you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe. And if you want to see what else I got from Brandon Blackwood, please keep checking my channel. I always, it's not out yet because you're watching this very new. Thank you so much. Or it's coming out next week. So stay tuned, subscribe, and then you'll know exactly when it comes out. So thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry if I'm all over the place. I think the next video is going to be better because now I'm back in the flow of it. So, um, yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye. Hey.